Yo, what is going on guys? It's Crypto TMG and I'm back with a brand new video. And before we even get started, man, um, I have to apologize for the audio in this video. I don't actually know what is going on. So if anybody is a whiz with OBS or any sort of audio systems on the PC, for some reason I had an update. And ever since then, the game, when I record, just sounds crazy. Um, not sure it's like a crazy echo, but the thing is, is when I'm actually playing the game, it's absolutely normal but the recordings just coming out completely different i've tried everything this is the reason why i'm bringing out this video uh one day too late normally i would bring out my um weekly setup video on the friday but yeah um crazily it's just it's just taking the turn for the worst man also of course um, i'm going to be getting a set of course of competition on the ps4 as well so i'm actually going to be transitioning over for probably a couple of weeks on the PS4, um, helping the guys on PS4 out with setups because obviously they're not going to have the third third party apps like Motec to help them with setups. It's pretty much you're going to have to be making your setups by feel. So I'm going to be doing some videos on the PS4 when that does release on the 23rd of June. Hopefully I get the game one day early because I pre-ordered it. So um, yeah, we'll see what we can do. Um, other than that, it's the Aston Martin at Brands Hatch and yeah, I haven't driven the Aston Martin too much at all since the... Uh, the, the car came out but I've decided to get in it uh, I had a little race in one of Jardier's races the other day around Zambo and it was pretty good man and the car definitely very easy to drive tons and tons of grip the acceleration does seem to be a little bogged down but other than that it's, it's definitely a good car man definitely a good car um, probably not the fastest in a straight line but still um, very nice feeling car good grip and uh, yeah, we'll see what we can do. But anyway, script to TMG, like and subscribe, hit the notification bell to catch my videos first, and peace.
So guys, as you can see, the sector times, um, after my uh, few runs that I had, you can see on our fastest lap, we actually didn't set any purple sectors, which again is quite bad in the sense that we didn't manage to get the best out of our, our sectors, but it also tells us that we have a lot more time in the car. Um, I think you could probably squeeze maybe a 22.6 out of the Aston, um, for me personally anyway. And uh, yeah, don't think I'll be going any much quicker than that. But the Aston, definitely a rapid car around here, man. Definitely a track that suits the car. Um, in general, around Brands Hatch, you want to have more downforce on your car because it's going to be more beneficial, especially in the race and keeping your tyres in. Um, having that extra downforce is going to be more beneficial to making sure your tyres stay in and you don't wear your tyres as quick. Plus, allowing you to be a little bit more aggressive. But um, I hope you guys do enjoy the setup. Um, it's the first one I've done in the Aston Martin for a little while. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. And here's the setup. 